Hey everybody, this is Sean with RC Crawlers and more, and I finished up my little short course. Starting over here, we got gate number one, then two, over here's three, we'll come around, over this, these are like little tiny metal piping, and I put some grip tape on it just to help it out a little bit. And there's gate number four, over the big mountain, through the little valley, gate number five, and then I have this long straightaway in the back, might put some uh, rocks back there, and then through here is gate seven, that comes all the way back around, to the finish spot. Alright, bear with me, I really... I'm going to try hard to do this because I've never did it with one hand and hold the camera. So, here we go. Take one. Come on. There you go. Now, I did do the free mods on it. did the lift. On the body and I've repositioned the shocks this is gonna be a little tough here reposition the shocks and then I put marine grease oh yeah in there. Oh, that was a close one. I'm running it on medium. A few other people said don't run it on medium or low. Let's see if we get a little bit of wall climb here. Let's see about getting that angle. Look at that. Right up on the wall. There we go. Oh, penalty hit the flag. Marker six. There we go. Yeah. Up and over. There we go. Hey, not doing too bad for my first time, I guess. Yeah, a couple other people that I've watched. Oop, there's another penalty seen the videos of uh, run it in high gear and there we go all done all right so let me show you what I've done just set that right there for a minute okay let's shake a little bit of this off all right we can see that but it is lifted did the back lift, then I moved the post in the front. It'd be easier if I just take this pin out to show you. Here we go. Loop to do. Lift that up. Here we go. There's the front post. I got it to where you see the first hole, and then I screwed it in. Let me see if I get that to focus. There it is. See where that tiny hole? on the top and then made it flush with the bottom and that's how I was able to raise the top I took my front bumper off because I'm planning on putting the headlights in there and taking a red sharpie marker and painting over the lights so it looks like it has red lights I seen it done it looks pretty neat oh, oh flip over there's the where I located that shock at because I took it off of the shock mount itself and put it there it actually works pretty well there it is and it sits up really nice let me see if i can get that to drop down a little bit come on i'm trying to do this one-handed sorry about that um but anyway i can change this track anywhere any way i want to do it now so it doesn't have to constantly stay like that but there it is I mean, that don't look pretty sweet. Oh, yeah, I'm 
going to order the red diff covers and the uh, red links. I might do a body change color on it. I'm not sure yet. I want to see what the red looks like on it first. But there it is. And there's a, a course. Yeah, it's pretty decent for what it is. It's got seven gates. I got 14 total if you do it. Go through the first seven. Then when you come back, there's another seven. So it's 14 gates. Um, I know they're not competition spread apart, but eh, it's it's something for now. Oh, I dug up a little trench here. I'm flying it down a little bit. What I used instead of getting dirt, I used a potting mix. Like a yeah, like I mentioned in my other video. I didn't put no plastic on here because I plan on expanding it and I don't really want to put my camera over that way because it's a mess and I want to expand my table out a little bit. You know what? Yeah, see, I got all this room. I just got to get rid of all this mess. So it'll be as long as this is and I already measured it. It's eight foot long. So it's eight foot by six or eight foot long, ten foot high shed. Um, Yeah. Eventually, I want to be able to mount my camera on here so I, ha I can use both hands. I'll figure out how to do that. But yep, there it is. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Uh, feel free to leave a like. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. And definitely uh, stay tuned for more videos because I plan on doing a whole different setup in a little while just want to see how this goes and you know if you get bored with something what do you do you change it but yeah there it is oh SEX 24 Jeep Rubicon it says Rubicon on it this is what I don't understand it says Rubicon right there is it a Rubicon Wrangler because on the box it says Wrangler okay. so I don't know if it's a Rubicon, Wrangler, if they're the same thing, I don't know. Maybe that one is a Wrangler. No, see, that one says Rubicon, too. Huh. Well, they all look alike, I think. This is that knockoff Jeep I was telling you about in my last videos. That is one heck of a beast right there. I took out all the toy-grade stuff and put all hobby-grade stuff in it. Yeah. That is beast. That is definitely worth it. Yeah. There it is. I know I can't. I'm just so excited. All right, guys. You know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't to already. This is Sean with RC Crawlers and more. Take care.